Ready for another question? Sure. This one's from David. David says, hey, David. a few shows back you showed a tweak you can make to Firefox by going into the About config yeah, okay. um, page and changing the general user agent dot vendor from Ubuntu to Firefox. Okay. This is so a great tweak. Oh, sorry. I was just going to say, this is referring back to when we talked about the new Hotmail in Ubuntu. That's oh, okay. what he's referring to there. So when we okay. changed the, the vendor tag in, uh, in Firefox. OK. OK. So his question? Um, he says that this is a great tweak as several websites uh, did not work before making this change. Uh, my, problem, to my problem is the value keeps going back to Ubuntu. Uh, it may be after a system reboot that the value resets. Do you know how to keep the value as Firefox and prevent, and prevent it from resetting to Ubuntu? I'm not sure if it would be after a, a, like an actual reboot, David, or if it's something maybe you're getting like a, an update uh, on your computer. Uh, what you can do is you can actually open up, um, let's see, we, you bring up your, like your places and then uh, home folder. I'll just kind of bring it up on my screen here. Okay. And you'll see that uh, I don't have any of my hidden folders shown. There's two ways to do this. Either you can hit Control H, and that's going to show you all of your hidden folders, and you can scroll down until you find .mozilla. Or alternatively, you can just you can just type it in. So hit Control L, and what Control L does is it brings up your location bar, and then you can go slash dot Mozilla after your username. So that's like you know home slash David slash dot Mozilla. When you click into that, you're going to see the Firefox folder. Go in there, and then bring up your profile here. So this there's just going to be some random number here or, or characters dot default. If you open that folder. Uh, look for a file called user.js. So you can just click somewhere and type us, and that's going to bring up your search down here. And you'll see that it never found that. So that means that the file doesn't exist. So I'm going to create it simply by right-clicking on a white space and go Create Document, Empty File. And I'm going to call this user.js. Open that file. And within that file, we can actually create um, strings to uh, automatically force certain settings as a default for this user. So I'm going to use general.useragent.vendor uh, equals Firefox. So in that user file, I've just pasted in the command, and it looks just like this. And I'll put this in the show notes for this episode as well. User, pr uh, user underscore pref bracket quote general.useragent.vendor unquote comma quote Firefox always with a capital F unquote and then the end bracket and a semicolon. If you save that file and close it, next time you open Firefox, it's actually going to uh, load that preference, so and it's going to keep doing that because that's in your uh, user's uh, profile. So that's kind of set as your default now. So that will always uh, set back even after an update. 